Welcome back. No sports fan wants to spend money on a Super Bowl ticket only to watch their team lose, right? Well, one company is looking to ease your pain if your team loses big time. Joining me right now is Game Hedge founder Warren Friss. Warren, good to see you. Good morning. So, how does it work? So, in other words, if Atlanta loses, um, my friends who are betting on Atlanta, they can get their money back. Well, if they go to the game and buy their tickets on Game Hedge. So, Game Hedge is a unique, one of a kind sports ticket marketplace where we treat fans the way we believe fans should be treated by giving them back something if the game doesn't go that That's way. an expensive proposition. I mean, your resale ticket site is offering a 50% refund off the price of a Super Bowl ticket if the team loses. Um, how do you make money on that? Well, we have done a tremendous amount of statistical analysis. We know how often it happens. We have some people really looking at it and studying it. And uh, we're willing to actually, you know, lower our profit margin by just a little bit to give something back to the fans. I mean, a loss of 28 points, isn't that rare in a Super Bowl? Uh, actually, it happens more than, than you'd think. It's happened 18% uh, of the time in the last 30 years or so. And it happened three years ago where Seattle beat Denver 43 to 8. Oh, my God. Okay, I missed that game. A team has only lost by at least 28 points five times since 1986, though. I mean, come on, it's not that. It's, an, it's not that often, right? It's not that often, but yeah. when it happens, you, uh, the fans are, are disappointed. If this happens again, how much money do you estimate you would have to refund? Well, we don't uh, disclose our numbers uh, for uh, competitive purposes, but uh, we will definitely have to refund some people some real money. Wow. So w what's, what's your you know, economic of the business? How do you monetize the business with a... With a uh, uh, with a plan like that? So we see it as a product enhancement. So with Game Hedge, every ticket we sell comes with a good game guarantee. And if the home team loses by a certain number of runs or points, we give them half their money back. So it costs us a little bit to do that, but we make enough profit to make up for that. Have you seen a, a big response from this? I mean, it seems like if a person can, can make that bet, I'm going to buy the ticket. Yeah, there's no reason not to buy from Game Hedge. We have a tremendous amount of loyal customers. They buy and buy again, and um, they're very happy, especially when they, they get their money back. <laughs> That's great. Well, so, well, they're happy, but they're not as happy because they wanted their team to win. They would have liked that, but they're <laughs> well, less disappointed. Right, sure. okay, so this is not your first time your company has offered a refund. This option gets, uh, sets Game Hedge apart from other ticket resellers. Tell us about that. So Game Hedge offers this refund on every ticket we sell. We sell tickets for four not just the sports. Super Bowl. Not just the Super Bowl. So any game you go to that you buy tickets from Game Hedge, you get 50% of your money back if the home team loses by a certain number of runs or points. There's no additional fees, no additional charges. Um, last night, for instance, in the NHL, there were four games played, and two of them were Game Hedge. So the fans that bought their tickets anywhere else left those games very disappointed. If they bought tickets from Game Hedge, they were much wow. more, much happier. So, I mean, are you... I, I, are you profitable or are you, are you money losing right no, now? No, we, we are profitable. You are every, profitable. We are profitable on every ticket we sell. Hey, how about the price of a ticket? Let's talk about that for a second. As of this week, tickets to Super Bowl 51 selling on the secondary market uh, for an average of $5,216. That's according to SeatGeek. Five grand. I mean, in comparison, last year's ticket uh, to see the Broncos face the Panthers was uh, $4,531. So... Prices are going up for the for the Super Bowl. Yeah, there is great demand for the tickets. There are actually fewer tickets in the marketplace this year than Why? last year. Um, the NFL has allocated a lot more tickets to teams and, and other people, so there's just fewer in the marketplace. Okay, but you know, there's been some talk about the NFL that you know the, the uh, attendance is down and the viewership is down. Does that not factor into the price of a ticket for the big game? I mean, we're seeing ticket prices actually on the rise in the last day or so. So uh, the lowest price yesterday was about $2,800. The lowest price today is about $3,200. Wow. All right. Prices good are going stuff. up. Wow. Warren, good to see you. Thank you. Thanks so much. Thanks Warren for Frist, thank you also to Modell Sporting Goods for this Patriots jersey and Falcons jerseys we will be wearing all week leading up to the Super Bowl right here on Fox. Get ready for the big game coming up.